Diego Costa found himself as part of an extremely funny fail by UEFA on Twitter. It happened just hours after the Spanish striker was finally able to sign for Atletico Madrid after months of waiting. It is so long ago that Antonio Conte replied to a nice text from Diego Costa to tell him that he didn't want him at the club this season. He might as well have replied new phone, who dis. The problem for Chelsea and more to the point their striker was the fact that Atletico Madrid, his preferred location, were banned from making transfers in the summer window so had to wait till January. Costa got a good reception from the fans when he was unveiled earlier this week. Image, Pa Images. Costa waited for his move and on January 1st was able to finally make his move back to the capital of Spain, having moved to the Premier League from Diego Simeon's team in the first place. When he initially decided to move the 29-year-old would have expected to be playing in the Champions League once again with Atleti, but the Blues helped knock them out, along with Roma, at the group stages, something UEFA amusingly forgot about when tweeting on Tuesday, Atleti could only finish third in their group. Image, Pi Images. With Atleti finishing third in their group the answer, at least until next season, is zero goals. And with someone quickly realizing the mistake that had been made the tweet was soon deleted. But not to fear the side who have twice lost to city rivals real in recent finals are in the Europa League this season, and the person in charge of social media soon put their error right, speaking at his unveiling Costa said, I thank the club for the effort they've made to bring me back. I thank them from the bottom of my heart. My fitness. You can see I'm looking much better now. I've prepared well for this and I'm looking forward to playing and helping the team. I've waited a long time for this. NOW I have my mind set on playing. As much as I've trained, it's not like playing a match and I'm tired of training so much. Atleti will be hoping that Costa's introduction will help them stay in second in La Liga and possibly push Barcelona all the way and another chance at winning the Europa League, which they last won in 2012, wouldn't go amiss either.